Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing The Sims 1. I'm gonna recreate my life and see how pathetic I can be. <laughs> we're gonna try our best, but The Sims 1 is hard. So I hope you enjoy the video. All right, let's create a family. Enter last name, call me. What matches my hairstyle? That maybe? That's kind of close. I kind of like this. I could see myself wearing that. Make him pale. This is as pale as he can go. Don't forget the cane, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> Zero to active? What the hell? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I'm really active. You're bullying me. I'm being cyber bullied right now. <laughs> I think we can put up playful and we can put up nice a bit. I'm I'm all right. You know, I'm okay. Right? You better fucking say yes. Bio for Kevin call me. Didn't get hit by car. <laughs> That's a very specific <laughs> bio. It's also his resume. The vanilla home. <laughs> it's just like, oh, did you name it that because of your complexion? And I'm like, no, that was just the name of it when I got it. <laughs> this is alternate reality Kevin who did not get hit by a car. So me, me hit by car. Him, no hit by car. Well, I'm not blind. I'm explaining to you. <laughs> <laughs> so he didn't get hit by a car, right? Slow down. You forgot a word. What does it say then? It says didn't get by car. You can fill in the blanks. <laughs> Why use many word when small word do same? <laughs> oh, feck's sake. The place is unfurnished. I got ripped off. I thought I was getting a good deal here. All I got was this unfurnished mess. Uh, the mystery man left an unmarked package at my door. The starter kit is a complimentary gift from the friendly folks at Magico Inc. Ooh, you see you say magic i say meth lab let's put that inside <laughs> that's right the kevin that didn't get by car goes straight into drug dealing <laughs> oop this escalated quickly that's what happens when you don't get by car i want to get a job okay so we got the military career i think there's always three isn't there wait what no okay well i guess my cv that i mentioned earlier isn't working probably because it's only four words and i'm missing a vital one maybe there's more jobs in this one <laughs> he's eager jesus who are all of you get off my lawn uh we need something for fun what's this the go-go cage what's that i want to get some chairs so people can watch me dance here's my plan i serve lunch i bait them in with free food as any good business would do right everyone grab your meals and get ready for the performance <laughs> oh yes shake that money maker Oh, they're even putting down the food. Oh no, they're they're cleaning up. It looks like he's trying to break free. You kind of insulted me on two ways there, lady, because not only did you stop watching me dancing, but you also threw away the fresh food that I just made for you. How can we kill this lady? Hold on. Oh no, the wrong Sim is gonna get in the pool. And he seemed like he was actually kind of enjoying the dancing, but oh, he's signing his own debt warrant. <laughs> Careful, Jesus, you really trusted your accuracy there. Feckin' hell. He missed the concrete by like that much <laughs> and made room for the next one to do the same thing. All right, have fun in the pool, everyone. I, I like that. It's like they're surrendering, you know? This may be one of the most terrifying scenes I have ever seen. There's just something really, really off-putting about the fact that he was just sitting there silently clinking away with his cutlery, watching them frozen in the pool. He doesn't seem bothered by it though. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> they just surrendered like, stop it, this is cruel and unusual punishment. Just kill us already. See, the cats love my music. They think it's great. They're like complaining about comfort. Anyway, night folks. I'm going to get some nap time and I'm getting ready for work in the morning. Hold on, let me just make this symmetrical. I love building in The Sims. <laughs> there you go. That looks nice. That is a warning right there. If anyone goes into that from here on in, it's their own damn fault. It's their own stupidity that got them into it. The carpool is in an hour, but at dark time, sun hasn't woken up yet. <laughs> My guy may not have gotten hit by a car, but he got hit by something. There's some definite brain trauma going on here. What the hell is that? Should I get in the carpool if it makes that noise? You know what? Feck it going. I don't have anything to lose. Don't wash your hands. I'm ready. <laughs> ready to be kidnapped. <laughs> All right. He got a promotion, I guess. Now he works as a convenience store clerk. How the hell did he get a promotion on his first day? <gasps> the circus? Yes, 
I just gave up a promotion to go work in the circus. I think we should focus on getting his mood up because it's really hard to keep them in a good mood and I don't want to let it slip too much to the point where I just can't get it back up. Yeah, yeah that's nice. This is incredibly <laughs> cursed. I didn't even mean it to be cursed. She, I just genuinely wanted to go in and try to be myself, but she stopped watching my dancing and I went into a rage. I couldn't control myself. Could we buy a sign? I'm thinking just for legal reasons, if we put up a sign warning people that, that is creepy as shit. <laughs> like, if you saw that and still went in, it's entirely your own fault. Oh, <laughs> he's crying for them. Oh, he's probably just having PTSD over the fact <laughs> I got all the trash on my, <laughs> in the way of the car. He's probably just crying because of the PTSD that he didn't get to dance, okay? Stop crying. You didn't know these people. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God, the carpool left. Yeah, you're crying. Stop it. Shut up. What? Was he just too upset to go to work? Was that it? Fucking upset with him now anyway, that's for sure. What the hell is that? Why am I being haunted? This doesn't make any sense. <laughs> this is going off the rails so fast. I just wanted to live my normal life. They're not going to interfere with me, right? They wouldn't want, like, revenge or anything, would they? Like, that wouldn't make any sense. They went in of their own accord. I just sat there eating salad while they did it. Just keep eating. Why did you throw it away? <laughs> what are you doing? I, that's not eating it at all. I don't understand what, he, what his deal is. I really really don't understand. Stop throwing it away. This is like me in The Sims Online. Now I know how it felt to be on the other side. This is such a waste of- and now he's pissed himself. That is fantastic. You know what? We'll shower anyway. It doesn't matter. A skunk has decided to make your lot its home. Why? <laughs> Give me one reason. Right, I'm gonna go pet the skunk and see if I can make some sort of a peace treaty. Like I'll give it offerings every day. Why are you screaming? Okay. All right. Get ready. Your first day of work is coming up. <laughs> he's gonna stink so bad. Get in that shower. I might need a maid, even though I don't really have the money for it. It's just, I'm struggling to look after myself. Oh, for feck's sake, there are cockroaches. I mean, they're on the road. Like, you wouldn't call, like, exterminator if, if you had cockroaches on the road. They'd think you're feckin' mad. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave him. Much like the skunk, I'm sure if I just leave it alone, there won't be any repercussions for that. Eat the roaches' protein. Knowing him, he'd eat one and throw the rest of them in the dishwasher. The carpool will arrive. Okay, he's a little bit uncomfortable, but I think he's in a good enough mood. What's his job again? He works in the circus as a popcorn vendor. He gave up a stable job job for it, which is questionable, but he's going to be one of those great success stories that people will look back and go, wow, you really took a shot at it and it worked out for you. Circus equals YouTube. I mean, to be fair, if you went and joined the circus, it's probably a more realistic career path than I'm going to start YouTube. Your parents would believe in you more. I don't understand where all this trash is coming from because I haven't thrown anything out <laughs> and it just keeps multiplying and I don't understand why, <laughs> but I'll ignore it for now. Out of sight, out of mind. So I'll just stay zoomed in because if you zoom out, out. The property looks a lot worse, but stay zoomed in. Pretty good. Wait a second. The room thing affects me when I'm at work. Oh my god, I need a maid stat. Because the room thing is affecting my mood when I'm outside. So when I'm at work, the thing is affecting me and I can't get a promotion. Why am I cleaning? I just hired a maid and then started cleaning myself. Stop mourning or I swear to god. Oh, there you go. God, the maid is going 90. Okay. Off to work. Please off to work. <sighs> Please go to work. All right, good man, good man. All right, no promotion today, but I think tomorrow is the big day. Throw party, I think. I'm throwing a party in advance. I'll be right over. Oh, oh, okay. I thought I could plan a party. I didn't realize that it would do it immediately. <laughs> Someone showed up in lederhosen at midnight to this party. <laughs> I don't know what party you think this is, but uh, it's not that kind of party. <laughs> okay, everyone, I'm making you food, and then we'll get the show on the road. It's too late. See you another time. Bye. It's too late. See you no really? Not the later holes in man. No. Hold on. I've already made you all food. Gang, come on. Well, I'm having this party with or without them. It's like 2 a.m. on a Wednesday. <laughs> He's just sitting there dancing alone, going a little bit insane by the looks of it. This is so depressing, honestly. What is this music? I don't know. He picked it. Switch to country. 
their loss later, Hosen. I don't care. I don't need you to have a good time. I'm having a great time alone. <laughs> Imagine that he's gonna come into work and like, oh, sorry, I'm exhausted. I'm partying all night. And they're like, oh yeah? Who'd you party with? Oh, it's just myself. <laughs> Put on some country tunes, got in the cage, and well, <laughs> the rest is history. <laughs> I think he'd lose his job. Oh, I'm gonna have a party when I get back to celebrate my promotion. Because, like, that was the plan originally, to have a party when I get home. But, I mean, I thought there'd be an option that would come up to plan it. I kind of forgot it would be immediately. One second, one second. I can talk to this lady to get a bit of social first before work. Please give me social. Give me all your social. Hand it over. <laughs> yes! Ticket taker! You now work 3 p.m., 6 p.m. starting immediately. Amazing! Throw party. Is everyone leaving? Again? Everyone left. This is just as depressing as the night before. I'll have a party in the morning then. <laughs> I just want to have a good time, you know? Get some hygiene going and my party's ready to start. This is why I have it in the bathroom. There we go. I'll make everyone lunch. There you go. And I'll get in the cage. Oh, for feck's sake, I'm heading to work. Yes. Look at this fun. It's skyrocketing. It's slowly. <laughs> Come on, somebody clap. Oh, the carpool's here. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I gotta go, folks. All right. Um, Be safe while I'm gone and nobody go in the pool or whatever you do. Maybe we can get something nice to go outside. Flamingos? Yes, please. You heard it here first, folks. Buy flamingos if you want to be happy. Uh, and also a cage. <laughs> I can't wait to have a party in the morning and show everyone my flamingos. Throw party. 7 a.m. party. Is that more acceptable to them? There we go. We can have a big bash. We can indeed. I call it the getting ready for work bash. <laughs> oh no, there's people getting in the pool. Oh, a queue has formed. <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. The pool is at max capacity. Hold on. I did get a promotion. I might be willing to expand it. <laughs> we just increased the pool size by 50%. <laughs> <laughs> Hop in, everyone. The water is compact. Why is the room a mess? What happened in here? God, you parties just get out of control sometimes. Before you know it, the music's off, there's trash everywhere, and there's three dead in the pool. <laughs> Wait, is that the... Oh my god, no, 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 no. All right, gang, hang around as long as you want. It's fine. I gotta go to work. What is that swimming? It's just swimming straight into them constantly. All right, I am in a good mood slightly. You would think I'm not because I'm super uncomfortable. I'm exhausted. And I'm having no fun and I kind of need to use the bathroom, but the room just looks great. <laughs> I'm just there thinking at work. Oh, all those flamingos waiting at home for me. <laughs> Can't wait to get back. I might get a promotion because I did get the skills. No, I didn't. I hate work. Chester has just died. Ah, good to meet you, Chester. I didn't catch your name earlier. Who the hell are you? Mama. Mama, <laughs> I just killed a man. Mama, it's me, your son. I work in the circus now. Also, I dance really nicely. Oh, someone else just died. Someone else died. Okay. Oh, I'm being haunted. Being haunted ain't all that bad. Like, what are they gonna do? You know, watch me dance in the dead of night? If anything, that's a good thing. Yay! Midway Kearney. I got a bonus. You know what that means? Meth lab. <laughs> the cat does not care, dude. I, I think you might have to get out and shoo it. Oh, he's making one of the good potions. The blue ones are good. I don't know how I remember that. It just came into my mind all of a sudden. That blue good. Ah! Oh, I'm not in the mood to work. For feck's sake. Well, an explosion would do that to you, I suppose. Let's get some sleep in, and I think we're ready for a promotion. Wait, I need- Oh, for feck's sake, I need a friend. What about later, Hosen? Joseph. Instead of interacting with a person like a normal human being to earn a friend, I could ask the magic genie. By the heavens and the earth, the spirits tell me your dwelling needs help. Here it is. He gave me more flamingos! <laughs> oh, for God's sake. I already had an army of them, and now he made an opposing army. That's not what I needed. I'll rub it again tomorrow. The lamp, I mean. The lamp. Let me call my neighbor for a chat. Tony fingers? What? What's that? I'm calling Joseph. I thought you'd never ask. I'll be over in a minute. Okay. Oh god, he, has he been stalking me? He literally showed up in a minute. What do you think of the flamingos? Are you feeling friendly towards me at all? You're minus two. I spent so much time talking to him to try and be friends, and I somehow made the situation worse. Alright, I'm gonna stuff my face now. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, it's here. Let's go then. Not in a very good mood. I might piss myself in your car on the way over. It'll be literally a carpool in a second. 
why the menacing music? Stop it. Like, there are a number of answers to why there could be menacing music. But <laughs> I just don't want it anymore. I just want to have a normal life, goddammit. I just want a promotion. I'm making potions, all right? I need a blue potion to save the day. What does a green potion do? Can I invite someone over? I'll invite Joseph and he can drink it. I don't know what it does. Uh, no, don't drink the potion. Oh! An evil clone? But I thought I was the evil one. What? <laughs> Can I be friends with myself? What even is The Sims 1? I have no idea. Talk about interests. All right, so far it's going pretty well. For an evil twin, you're not too bad, you know. Oh wait, minus 14 all of a sudden. What did you do? I wouldn't say that's really evil. I would just say you're being kind of a dick. Oh, Joseph is leaving. I'm gonna make a potion. Why don't you enjoy your time in the pool, evil Kevin? Will you leave me alone? Christ almighty, clean the lamp, call the genie. We need something. By the power of the lamp, the lamb and the everlasting life, I command the next mortal to lay eyes and you be smitten with love. At least it wasn't my evil twin. It was this Claire. What? You feckin' Egypt. <laughs> you need this. You need a friend for work. This is actually so depressing. She's gonna start dating my evil twin. That's fine. I'm going to work. Can you somehow leave your sim self alone? He's been through a lot. I'm trying to help him, believe it or not. Like, granted, some of the choices I'm making are goofy, but even when I'm trying, like, legit trying to help him, he's just having none of it, you know? Like, I just want him to be happy. Will the genie be kind today? Friends! Yes! Friends! Yes! Make me a friend! Hey, this spell actually works! Looks like somebody's taking a liking to you! Fantastic! Passionate kiss. He's giving me a little tap on the shoulder. You know what? You're not so bad after all. And then my guy's like, you know what? You neither. And tries to plant a kiss. Today's the big day. Here comes the promotion. I've got a friend. My performance has been described as average, but I'm going to come in in a great mood and I'm going to blow them away with the fact that I made a friend. <laughs> like, how the hell did you manage to make a friend? Ooh, magic. <laughs> Literally. Why did I not get promoted? This is rigged against me. Just focus on keeping in a good mood and we'll call our friend in the morning. Gunther's at work. God damn it. I guess Joseph, he's got nothing else going on on, I suppose. Poor Joseph is at work. Don't shame me for not working. Like, I also work. I'm just not working right now. God, I wish I had mold people living in the walls. Or what about Mama? Will you come over? Uh, hurry up. The carpool's gonna be here. I literally am not allowed to have a social life here. Just tell two jokes, and th that's all we can do. That's our daily dose of fun. Goodbye. Like, you invited me over to tell me a feckin' knock-knock joke, and then you just drove away. Nice one. Thank you. Appreciate it. You can use the pool if you want as well, but you'd want to be pretty stupid, I'm afraid. Are you serious? I'm losing a friend. I just tried to call you this morning. Christ, this game is cruel. In the morning, straight away, I'll just call someone over to chat. I'll call him over at the crack of dawn to get some conversation going. Oh my god, did he bring me a little potted plant? Oh, oh Gunther, you're something else you are, aren't you? I'm gonna try and tickle him. I know it's risky, but I think it could work. Ah, talk about cats. Just keep talking about cats. No, stop screaming. Stop it. Just talk about cats. And now, dance. There you go. Look how much fun you're having. You flooded my toilet. Are you serious? Someone is willing to buy this for a hundred bucks. I'm selling the toilet. That's a good deal. I'll buy another one. Repossess? I'd like to see you try. What are you gonna take? I have nothing of value. Please don't take the guitar. Are you serious? <laughs> that is the only thing I cared about. That and the potion machine. All right fine. See you in a month. <laughs> I'm gonna get home and I'm gonna celebrate my definite 100% promotion by robbing the genie's lamp. Are you serious? You didn't get promoted. Oh, Jesus. Chat, do you want fire or water? Oh, that thing. I forgot. The last thing that I cared about in the house has gone up in flames. Get in the shower, dude. There's water in there. Yes, it burned down. Thank you, chat, for killing the one thing I cared about. <laughs> go to sleep, dude. Just sleep it off. This is one of those days you're better off just forgetting about. I said go to sleep. Jesus. It's all work and no play. It's making him a dull boy. The carpool left without me. Jesus, make a potion. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And so he must be extremely strong by now. Yes, he's making a blue one. You're in a good mood as is. Let's call neighbor, right? We'll make a friend and we'll sacrifice our mood for now. Don't wash your hands. Shake hands. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> good to meet you. <laughs> now, we're going to get social up. We're going to talk about dogs. We're going to become best of friends. I'm going to consume that potion in the morning so I'm in a fantastic mood and I'll get my 
promotion. What? Dude, come on. No, 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 no. My happiness, you're drinking it. Stop it. Yes, stop, stop. You literally looked over your shoulder, saw me, and drank the feckin' thing anyway. Get in the feckin' pool. That tasted great. You feel totally refreshed. Well, thank you so much for letting me know about that. I cannot believe it. And then he just leaves. He just stood there idling in a fantastic mood, and then he just left. I've forgotten all about my need for promotion. I just need that man to die. Gunter's at work. Duh. I bet he's having a great day, isn't he? All right, head to work. He's in a fantastic mood. I would have 100% got a promotion. Why is this relationship deteriorating so fast? It's down to 33 now. Maybe I need to summon the genie again. All work and no play. Uh, work. Yes, please. Give me promotion. I broke your skills. He got rid of the body and the charisma point that I needed. Hold on. I just want to make this into a smaller room for no particular reason whatsoever. Gunther, would you like to come over? I'm making meatballs. Count me out. This guy is an absolute dick. <laughs> like, he took everything from me. I swear to God, if, if he says I don't even know who you are. Okay, yes, he's coming over. Okay, come on in, Gunther. Why don't I make you some food or something? Mm, there. Uh, can I use the voodoo doll? Use on Gunther. Yes. Yes! Take that, Gunther! Feckin' hell, that is disturbing. Jesus Christ, he says as he clicks on it another 15 times. It's probably her looking for her husband. Oh, he's falling asleep standing up. I'd like to wake him with the voodoo doll, but I think I can only use it a certain amount per day, you know? I kind of like that he's suffering a long and painful death in there, though. Um, I might move this as well. This is the only important thing in the kitchen, right? He woke up and he's like, the bastard came in when I was asleep. <laughs> oh, wait, it's here. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, well, there goes my day at work. Earth and air. More flamingos, please. Thank you very much. Roaches. Oh, for feck's sake. This is a disaster. This is a feckin' disaster. Kevin lost his job. He's fallen asleep again. He's in there with the dead plant that he gave me. It's kind of symbolic, isn't it? It's like at one point, we were such good friends, blossoming, such a nice relationship. And now it's withered and dead, like you will be, Gunther. I would like money, please. <gasps> then, unrelated, it just synced up by chance that I, I picked the money and then the next notice was about the bills I'm not paying. The genie hasn't done his spell yet. Hold on. Give me all the riches in the world so I can afford my bills. He gave me more bills. 898 three times. Are you kidding me? Potion. Make potion. For feck's sake. Pizza. Eat pizza. <laughs> oh god, the pizza's gone off. This is going horribly. You know, for brief moments when he's eating bathroom pizza off the ground, life kind of feels okay. Oh, he's back to screaming now. <laughs> pizza and screaming. So relatable. Just a normal Friday for me. I can't wait till tomorrow. Okay. Pretty good mood. Make a potion. Yes, he's making a good potion. Throw party. I can socialize and try and make a friend. Oh, he drank it. Okay. Okay, you know what? Wait, it doesn't do all of them. It did the ones I didn't really even need. Wait, she loves me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If I talk to her enough, then maybe I can make a friend. Please be friend. Why is this game so unfair? Like, you have to be so careful about what you pick. Will you stop screaming in the yard? You're scaring the flamingos. How come they're scaring each other and they like that? But when I just try and make conversation, everyone hates me. Oh, here we go. Yes. Now that's a party. You love to see it. You really, really do. Uh, at least I get my kitchen back now as well. Can I dismantle that wall while you're in there? Deepest sympathy, Gunter's just died. This has been my most successful party yet. Why are you all crying? The life of the party is here. Hold on, let me get the genie out. He'll make you all forget. He always makes things better. I must be losing my touch. Looks like someone's angry at you. I, I mean, it doesn't really matter. I didn't have any friends, so I had nothing to lose. He's having such a tough life, and none of it is his or my fault. It's just been a bad draw of the cards, I'm afraid. Alright, I'm just gonna start making potions and drinking potions. And there's nothing you can do to stop me. There you go. I feel great. Make another potion then. The police are here. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Just ignore them. <laughs> she can physically see that I'm using like a meth lab here in through the door. Just ignore them. They'll go away. Kids can smell these toxic fumes a mile away at school. Whatever you're making, knock it off. You've been fine 500 bucks. <laughs> he can't win like. Come on. <laughs> I like how he doesn't even glance at her and just continues to make the potion. <laughs> She's coming back. <laughs> God damn it. Keep making these potions. You're going to be the smartest man on earth and you're staying alive because the potions are putting you in such a good form. There we go. Come on. Hunger. All right. Comfort is up. You're repossessing stuff. No, go away. I'll throw my potion at you. 
<laughs> okay, wait, no, hold on. I didn't tell you to drink that one. I don't know what the yellow one does. Your personality has been permanently reversed. That's fantastic news. Look at him. He's still nice. He's neat. He's outgoing. He's active. Oh my God. By being such a shitty person, that's that was amazing. Orange. What does orange do? I'm willing to drink. Orange looks like a friendly color. Kevin has turned invisible. Okay, now we're really winning. <laughs> Not only is he a better person, he's out of everyone's sight. Can I clean this yet? I'm in such a good mood. I think if I clean the genie lamp, then I'm guaranteed to get something good. Fire or water. You know what? I'm in such a good mood. I'm convinced it'll work. Fire. My potions! After being warned by the police so many times. <laughs> but he just wouldn't listen, would he? Call the fire brigade, leave the door unlocked, and hop right into bed. You'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, you know what? I think that went pretty okay. All things considered at the end of it. Because we killed his friend. His only friend. And uh, then we reversed his personality. So he's actually a decent person. And we'll probably make friends, get a new job, and live a happy life, I would have to assume. Ah, oh, the house looks like shit, but overall, I'm pretty happy with what we've done here today. That is the end of the video, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed. Please consider subscribing if you want to see more. I would love to have you around. Uh, the regulars, thank you again for watching. Appreciate you all either way, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye.